What's up Sailor Senshi? I'm Sailor Snuffs. Welcome to my YouTube channel all about Sailor Moon news, merch reviews, and how-tos. I am very excited about today's episode, which I am filming in two parts. This is Artist Alley. I love that name. I think it's so cute. So if you ever go to anime conventions, there's usually a part of the vendor hall where people are selling stuff called Artist Alley. And that is where you can find a whole bunch of really amazing art and crafts that are created by fans of different fandoms. So oftentimes when I go down Artist Alleys, I'm able to find a whole bunch of really cool Sailor Moon crafts or Sailor Moon art that different fans have created or different artists. I have done one of these videos previously when I shared the beanie, like a winter beanie that was knitted that I found on Etsy. So I'm going to continue this and just call it Artist Alley because it makes sense. So I will be featuring strictly products that are created by fans. I will also be linking to each of these creators down below in the description so that you can find them so you can also support these different artists. So without further ado, let's check out part one of my two-part artist alley. This was actually a Christmas present from one of my friends. Uh, so I don't have the creator's name, but I did want to show you this anyway because it's beautiful. This is a mask, which I've been using before I was vaccinated. Even now, I'm gonna be using it whenever I feel like I need to take caution. But this feature is a really cool vinyl holographic print of Sailor Moon against this gorgeous galaxy background. I'm sorry, there's tons of makeup on it. And it also has a pocket for a filter. So I do have a filter inside of here. The two sides are elastic and they also have adjustable ear straps, which I love that the ear loops or the ear straps are adjustable so that I can fit this to my face. There's also a metal nose piece up at the top which makes it very comfortable to wear. This was also a Christmas present from this past year. This was actually made by my cousin and my grandma gave it to me for Christmas. This is a pretty hefty piece of wood that my cousin ended up etching with this art of Sailor Moon. And it's kind of shiny, which I thought was really cool. And they also put a little hanger on the back of it so I could hang it up. So I have had this hanging in my Sailor Moon room for the past couple of months and I absolutely adore it. I don't know if he does stuff for sale, but if he does, I will definitely link it down below. Okay, so these two pins, I got lucky. I gotta say, I just like randomly checked this person's website and I found these and I was like, dude, I love these. So these two pins are from Sailor Kraken Pins. Link down below. First, we have this really cute one of Adult Chibiusa, and I really like the background on this pin. It's really pretty. The back is blank. And then we have this one, which features Sailor Moon, and she's got a glittery uniform on. I love the screen printing in her face. I think it looks really, really good. And that was one of the reasons that I decided to get this pen. Now this one does have a print on the background. It says Sailor Kraken Pins Limited Edition. Beautiful pens. I'm a huge enamel pen collector. So anytime I can find really nice pens like these, I tend to grab them up if I can. Sailor Kraken pins also sent a little bag of Skittles and that's one of my favorite candies, so I appreciate it. This next pin was sent to me for review by somebody who I have been following for a very long time and I've never gotten a chance to check out their pins. So I was really, really excited about this and I'm so happy that they reached out to me about it. I'm, I can't wait to show you this pin. It's absolutely beautiful. So this pin is by Pretty Geeky Pins over on Instagram. This is a brand new pin that just came out quite recently. This one also features some beautiful screen printing of all of the Inner Sailor Senshi. I love how detailed this pin is, even in the fact that their lips feature a teeny tiny little line of a light pink color like they have lipstick on. It's so pretty. I also see no defects. I don't see any bubbles, no scuffs, no weird coloring. It looks like a perfect pin. It's also huge. This thing is as big as my palm. It's a very big pin. So this is the Moonies pin and oh my God, I love that these are little hearts. I love the heart stoppers. Oh, those are cute. Even though this is gonna end up on my pin board, I'm totally keeping these. That's so adorable. So on the back it says Moonies and this is LE50, so that's limited edition to 50. I feel honored to own this pin and I am so excited that I was able to share it with you. Absolutely adore it. This is beautiful. It is beautiful. So Pretty Geeky Pins is over on Instagram. They also have a whole bunch of really beautiful Disney pins, which is how I found them. But if you are interested, 
I will put their link down below as well. I also love that they included this sticker and the sticker features the same print. It's so pretty, very cute, absolutely love it. So thank you, Pretty Geeky Pins. This is going to go in a very fancy place on my pin board. All right, there is a creator that I found on Etsy a long, long, long time ago, and I finally went on Etsy and just went nuts on her Etsy shop because she makes these beautiful vinyl graphics, and I put vinyls on my car, I put them on my laptops, I put them on my PC tower. They go all over the place in my house. So I wanted to show you these, especially because she also sent a whole bunch of bonus stickers because my, my order was so big. So <laughs> she sent me extras. So I'm really excited to show you this lot of vinyl stickers, which I'm pretty obsessed with. Okay, so this is my collection of all sorts of vinyl stickers. These are all from a maker named Creek City Graphics over on Instagram, on Etsy. They make all sorts of graphics, not just Sailor Moon ones, but I really like the variety of options that she served up. So that's why I was very interested in purchasing from her. So I got a whole bunch of little mini vinyl stickers that were bonuses, a lot of different ones. We have this cute bunny, the compact, so pretty. We have a bunch of different ones. These are so adorable. So there's a whole bunch of bonus items that she included in the package. Oh my gosh, still going through bonus items. Got a purple crescent moon, Hotaru's sign. Hotaru is one of my favorites. She also asked me who's my favorite Sailor Senshi and I was like, oh, probably Hotaru or Sailor Moon, one of them. I have like four favorites, but those are the two top ones. Hotaru's symbol in the middle of the stars. We have a heart, crescent moon again. And we have the Collide Moon Scope, so many, so many different ones. And these all come in a bunch of different styles and I was super excited about that. Look at this, the transformation pen. That's so freaking cool. That was a bonus one. We have this beautiful one of Sailor Saturn. So cool. And then I think the rest of these are the ones that I actually purchased. So I have a Moon Tiara in a holographic vinyl print. Then we have Sailor Moon in this beautiful rose gold holographic with blue eyes. I love this one, this silver holographic print of Sailor Moon and Tuxedo Mask kissing. Oh, it's so pretty. This one's really beautiful of Usagi looking up at the crescent moon. Oh, this was one of my favorites. I love that she prints different colors for the features of these characters. So in this one we have Saturn within the planet Saturn. Isn't that cool? Princess Serenity in this silver holographic. Really nicely done. Oh, I had to get these three. So these are Luna, Artemis, and Diana. Artemis, it's kind of hard to tell, but that's also a holographic white color. We have a rainbow hollow of manga super Sailor Moon. And then we have Sailor Chibi Chibi Moon. Oh, she's adorable. This one is Usagi looking up at the moon in white. These two were really cute. I had to get both of them. Luna and Artemis sleeping. Oh, they're so cute. And then I have a whole series of logos because I wanted to put these on places like my car, definitely my PC tower. So I got this one, which is a glittery silver holographic. Uh, this one is more of like a purple purplish pinkish color. We of course have the rose gold. That's one of my favorites. And then this one, the rainbow, oh, looks so good. I can't wait to put that one somewhere. It looks awesome. This one's pretty cool too. It's like a rain style for the silver. I think they all look amazing. Which one is your favorite? Let me know. And I don't know of any other makers who design vinyl stickers that are this large. So I really like the size, which you can choose the sizes whenever you're checking out on her Etsy store, so you do have the option of choosing different sizes. Of course, what she has in stock totally depends on the materials available at the time. All right, next I have some stickers, which I wanted to show you. These are also very cool. These stickers are by Porcelain Lace. I will link to her down below. So Porcelain Lace, I wanted to point out because she has created avatars for a lot of the Sailor Moon YouTubers that I'm familiar with, as well as myself. In fact, I will feature my Sailor Moon avatar right here that she had created for me. I love it, it is so cool. I actually commissioned her to do another piece for me that I was able to sell as a sticker. So I've uh, turned one of her pieces into a sticker myself. But she created these awesome stickers of Sailor Moon wearing a mask. 
And this is her like Sailor Moon says, wear a mask sticker. And I absolutely adore these. So I was really happy to get my hands on them. Thank you so much Porcelain Lace for sending these to me. And thank you for the work that you did on my avatar. I absolutely adore them so much. So cute. I realized that we're nowhere near Halloween, but I still wanted to buy these pins because they are so cute. I bought four pins. They came with this cute postcard that says, thank you for your order. Enjoy. They're from Pin Me Nerdy. Pin Me Nerdy on Instagram. I believe these are out of stock now, but these are four different Halloween themed pins. These feature Black Lady and Mistress Nine. There's both a normal version as well as a glitter variant, and they do feature slightly different colorings. So I just ended up getting all four because I couldn't choose between them. They are so cute. Anytime somebody makes pins that are Halloween themed, I'm like, I have to have those. I have so many as it is right now, but these are just gonna add to my collection of Halloween themed pins. So these, these were done really well. I'm so glad that I was able to purchase them. I have to show you how gigantic this pin is because it's like the size of my palm again. All these giant pins, I'm gonna run out of space I'm gonna have to get a second display because y'all are making huge pins and I can't help myself. This pin is by Cosmic Skies Pin. Again, this is one of those ones where I went to Cosmic Skies website and I randomly found this pin in stock, so I purchased it. Lucky, because I think it's out of stock by now, but super pretty. Look at how beautiful this pin is. It's huge, it's very big. The pink in the background is kind of a pearlescent. There's some excellent screen printing going on in her face. Very, very well detailed, really good design. And the skirt is just, there's so much detail going on. It just looks really good. So I don't know who your pin manufacturer is, Cosmic Skies, but they're doing a really good job. Next we have these two pins by Nerdy Girl Pins. I will also link to these on Instagram. These are from the Transformation series by Nerdy Girl Pins. They've actually made a ton of pins in this line by now, so you do have time to catch up and get a whole bunch of different ones. So of course, first we have Sailor Moon doing her transformation, and she has a whole bunch of ribbons behind her as well as this beautiful glitter. It looks amazing. I love the bright, vibrant colors. And then Sailor Chibi Moon is also transforming and she has the ribbon circling around her as well as this gorgeous teal. I really like that teal color. It's very vibrant. I really like how both of these are very vibrant in color and they're detailed, really pretty. So that is Nerdy Girl Pins tag if you want to find them on social media that's their instagram thank you so much nerdy girl pins for sending over those pins for me to review and to check out on the channel because i think they're absolutely adorable and they are also going to find a beautiful place on my pin display i should take a picture of my pin display and show you guys i have so many i have another mask that i wanted to show you this was made by one of my friends on twitter uh, if she is still making masks, then I will link her down below. If she's not in that business anymore, then I won't link it. But she made this mask for me and sent it over and I thought it was so pretty. It was a beautiful gift. This one also has a nose bridge, a metal nose bridge inside of there. And it's a cloth mask. It's a very, very soft cloth. This one features this print of Sailor Moon's compact and the moon stick. And then we also have the little transformation pen right there and a whole bunch of roses. And she makes hers, or at least she made this one, with ribbons that you tie around your neck. So we have a red ribbon as well as this Sailor Moon ribbon. Ain't that cool? This one does not have a space for a filter, but it is printed with two pieces of fabric. How many things have I showed in this video so far? Because I'm going to do two parts, so I'm going to split it in two. One, two, three. I think this is about halfway, so I'm going to go ahead and finish off with one more pin, and then I will wrap it up and I'll film part two. All right, so this pin I found secondhand, again, with the witchy Halloween theme. I can't help myself. I found this on Mercari. It was a pretty good deal. Mamobot is a creator on Instagram who I've been following for a little while now. Mamobot makes a ton of different pins and they all feature this same kind of illustration. It's, it's a very, very unique design and I really like it. I think it's super cute. I like the glitter that's included in her shoes and the wand and the hat. I think that's really pretty. And I love how flowy the hair is. 
It's gorgeous. Look, there's a little Luna. So these are the links for Mamobot in case you are interested in checking them out. And we're done. That is all of the artist alley that I wanted to show off in today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I know that was a lot to go through, but again, I have all the links down below. Thank you so much to the creators that sent over products for me to review on the channel. Again, I truly appreciate it. And I love being able to support you with my own platform. I think that's amazing. And I am more than happy to support creators, especially when you have small businesses. If there's any specific creators that you want me to check out on the channel, you want me to check out their products, definitely let me know down in the comments below or tag me on their Instagram so that I can find them. Again, my Instagram name is Sailor Snubs. You can always find me over there. I will also be posting a lot of these and tagging the creators on my Instagram page too. Don't forget to subscribe to check out the second episode of Artist Alley coming up very soon and I will see you next time. I'm Sailor Snubs. Jane.